Welcome back, Dale Myers Football Advance. This is the conclusion to cover four defense. Prevent defense or quarters coverage? So we've already talked about the basic prevent defense um, and being you know good in certain situations. And we gave you guys a, a few variations of cover four defense. And there was a couple things that I left off. So one was that we were talking about uh, some base alignment. Different ways to play it. But in general, your corner, 7, 11 yards off the number one receiver outside leverage. Lots of teams will play these two safeties aggressive. Remember, they're also involved in a run game, 7 to 10 yards off the ball. So you offensive coordinator types, that's one reason, one way you'll know a team is running quarters versus cover two. Those safeties in cover two tend to be a little bit further off the ball normally. Um, and again, this corner, 7-11 as well. However, some teams run a variation where these corners are impressed. Remember, we said there were two types. You, you had to define your coverage as MOD, man only deep. So once they become a deep receiver, they go past vertical whenever I define my vertical. If they pass vertical, we're man coverage. Now that is susceptible to deep rub routes, but then there's man everywhere he goes. If you're the kind of old Michigan State quarters coverage teams, the press quarters coverage, I love that press version, but you better have some good corners. If you don't have good corners, don't do that. Um, but get these guys up and press, and it's weird man everywhere he goes. Now, again, the problem becomes, what you going to do with this guy? Who's it man? Is it this guy or this guy? So, and on that note, another issue with this version of quarters is Notice how both of your backers are outside the box. And in my offense, this guy right here is like the fastest or most explosive guy on my offense normally. So you pretty much have to pull. Will is not going to be hip right there outside of that end. Will is going to have to get his butt out here. Especially, I know you DCs are saying you like to put three over two, right? I have two. You want three over here. You want three over two. One, two, three over my two. But that's good. Except now look what I got inside here. So... You OC types, when they do that, put both of those backers outside the box, you get your quarterback run game, and y'all go to town. But anyway, back to cover four defense. Um, so, press quarters coverage, man everywhere he goes. Again, I do love that variation, as long as you got the corners to do it. Now, the last thing we quickly want to talk about is to read. There's a version of the quarters coverage that allows you to remember we were getting eaten up in the passing game, the quick game, the mesh routes, slants and hitches. They destroyed um, traditional quarters. To read, it's, I read the number two receiver. So over here I have a, a route combination drawn up, just curl flat. And uh, I'll draw another one over here. Um, the basic, uh, uh, I mean, it could be slants, it could be whatever, whatever we want it to be. But... We're reading the number two receiver. Corner and safety are going to stay deep unless the number two, it depends on what number two does. If two goes out, that triggers this corner to come down. Number, one's, number one sees that. His eyes go to number one. If one is still going vertical, he has to go vertical with it. In this case, number one is doing the curl, so we're going to rob the curl, get up underneath the curl. All right, so this is two read. We're reading number two. Now, if this guy, number two, would have gone vertical, then this corner would have stayed vertical. Or, or he would have ran with number one, and then, you know, we would have delivered late here. All right, so two read defense, and again, we're going to do a whole, a separate video on two read. We're going to talk, we're going to go more in depth on quarters coverage. Quarters coverage against the spread, against the trip. So we're going to go deeper, but I really do like to read because I can get, you know, I can defend the bubble screens and stuff. If we get this right here, we get the bubble, this guy's coming back. Now, of course, the challenge is what if you get bubble and then you get a takeoff route? So we do have to coach that. If you're going to run it, you better be aware of the challenges there. So this free is now in the bind. He has to get it behind over there. Um... Uh, so that can be problematic, but I do like to read. Again, you're reading the number two receiver. Each of these comes with their own set of uh, strengths and weaknesses. 
There are some things we could do to two read to put you in the bind. I already talked about one of them is you got to pull that wheel out of the box. This inside run game is starting to look pretty good to me. So, to quickly recap, the first thing we said was prevent defense. Are all of these things have in common? What do all of these versions have in common? Well, I have the ability to defend four verticals up the field. And, and in doing so, I can basically separate my field into quarters. That's why it's called quarters covered. One-fourth of the field, two-fourths, three-fourths, four-fourths of the field for those of you who are math guys like me. Um, prevent defense, everybody just run deep. We're going to give up all the short stuff. We don't care. We're going to rally and tackle. That one's kind of easy to do, right? This version right here, all the other variations, great against the deep ball. Awesome because these guys, these safeties are reading. They can get involved in a run game. That is the strength of it. Um, when you do run it, you have to decide where is, where am I declaring vertical? How am I going to defend the deep rub rocks? Because man everywhere he goes, or man, man only deep. Those deep rub rocks can get you. Um, and again, the two read coverage, also known as trap coverage. Again, we'll talk about that later. So this is a quick touch on um, cover four. We will go into more details coming soon, coming soon. Leave a comment below. Why do you like the cover four? Or what do you like against the cover four? My name is Dale Myers with Football Advance. We'll talk soon. Take care.